This is Day in the Life, part of a series of videos showcasing the amazing diversity of health-related jobs. In these interviews, we'll hear a little bit about what a day in the life of a health professional may look like. We will explore public health-related careers, such as an epidemiologist. We will consider the importance of bioinformatics in health and healthcare delivery in our technology-driven world. One thing I do is I synthesize large volumes of data in order to answer questions about the relationship between behaviors uh, and diseases and the relationship among different diseases. Uh, some of the most important things that I do are to translate those findings for my scientific colleagues and for the lay public. We try to find ways to make our findings useful to everybody. So for example, if I'm doing a study to look at factors associated with the development of diabetes. Um, it is important for a doctor who treats individuals with diabetes to know what we find about who is at risk for developing diabetes. So that translation on many levels. As an informatics specialist, I try to look at the world through a data lens. I try to see uh, how uh, data is being collected, how it's being gathered throughout the uh, healthcare uh, delivery system. I try to identify opportunities where we might be able to take that data as it's collected or identify new ways for us to collect that data. And then take that uh, to combine it maybe with other data sets to analyze it to create uh, new or novel insights into how we might best uh, and most efficiently deliver care. And you lead a major community academic medical center relationship called SHITRAC. Can you explain that a little bit? Sure. It stands for the Chicago Health IT Regional Extension Center. It's funded by the Office of National Coordinator. And the goal was really to try to uh, help uh, primary care providers achieve meaningful use of electronic health records. And uh, it's been a great success. Uh, in that it's helped over 100,000 primary care providers across the country achieve that goal. But more importantly, it's provided this really solid foundation nationwide for electronic health record enabled clinicians. And that is creating uh, all this new data uh, that researchers like ourselves can now take advantage of and use to, again, create novel insights around how best to take care of patients. I see patients and the care for older adults and communicate with their family members. We conduct research and answer the scientific questions we have in terms of how do we better people's health. We also engage in scientific writing. We also engage in understanding how can the research that we conduct impact community practice and policy. And how do you impact health? We can impact health at multiple levels through the care of a patient to be compassionate and thoughtful and caring at the individual level. We work with the community to better health by understanding community needs and provide the best practice strategies for community organizations. And we influence and inform policy through the research and clinical experiences that we do. Thank you. Thank you so much for being here today. Thanks for having me.